Hello, today's video we have the following content. The Legend of Tibetan Sea Ziozon's new drama is online. The main cast all appear without makeup, and everyone has top looks. It is necessary for Zhen Ziyalong to challenge himself by filming a costume drama. After all, The Legend of Zhen Huan is extremely popular, and even the supporting actors can still share in the success of Zhen Huan. This opportunity cannot be missed. Directed by Zhen Ziyalong and starring Ziyozan and Zhang Jingai, the period drama Legend of Tibetan Sea is a historical drama. In the process of pursuing the truth of the blood feud, Zhang He was not only deeply involved in the whirlpool of revenge, but also involved in the game of officialdom. Intricate light and dark lines were intertwined, and unexpected reversals frequently occurred. There is a complicated relationship between him and the heroine, involving mutual seduction and mutual use. What will be their final destiny? The acting skills and looks of the actors are all top-notch, the drama is full of quality, and the plot setting is very fascinating, involving elements such as revenge, conspiracy, love between family and country, tomb building, etc., which makes people look forward to it very much. This IP is already well known, and with the addition of A-list stars, the plot will definitely be more exciting and highly anticipated. When I think of Ziozon having just played a scene of Mongolian horseback riding an archery in The Legend of the Condor Heroes, accompanied by a beautiful woman, he looks so heroic. Wow, that scene must be very exciting for male testosterone. According to rumors, the beautiful tea house proprietress is set to be the heroine, and Zhang Jingai seems to be closer to the role than other heroines who are rumored to be too sweet. Among the new generation of actors, she is obviously more suitable to play the role of a mature and mature woman with rich connotations. I believe she will have good performance effects. The play is a drama about a male protagonist's plot, and both the director and the lead actor are excellent, making the project very attractive. In addition, the director will select the most suitable important roles because he knows how professionals do professional things. Of course, we will never choose an actor like Zhen Ziyalong, but welcome all outstanding actors to join this project. Next news. Create excitement in sports with Ziozon and open up unlimited possibilities. Ziozon is the global spokesperson for Lining's trendy sports products. His cooperation with Lining can be traced back to March 26, 2021, when Lining's official Weibo announced that Ziozon became its global spokesperson. As a well-known sports brand in China, Leaning has been committed to promoting Chinese sports culture and sportsmanship. As a well-known artist, Ziozon's image and influence are consistent with the concepts of Leaning brand. Through cooperation with Ziozon, Leaning hopes to attract the attention of more young consumers and increase the brand's popularity and influence. The news that Ziozon endorsed Leaning aroused widespread attention and discussion. His fans expressed their support and expressed their love and support for him by purchasing Leaning products. At the same time, this also caused some controversy and doubts. However, no matter what, the cooperation between Ziozon and Leaning has brought certain benefits and opportunities to both parties. Creating excitement in sports and opening up unlimited possibilities is not only the common goal of Ziozon and Leaning, but also the message they hope to convey to consumers. Through sports, people can challenge themselves, surpass their limits, and realize their dreams and goals. The cooperation between Ziozon and Leaning will inspire more people to actively participate in sports and pursue a healthy and active lifestyle. Next news. Ziozon tells you what a beautiful man in ancient costume should look like in the legend of Tibetan Sea. He has a body like a pine and a face like jade. Ziozon in the legend of Tibetan Sea tells you what a beautiful man in ancient costume should look like. Not everyone can play it. For example, Liu Shishi, who is also a 85-year-old actress, was in perfect condition in one thought off the mountain, her acting skills were online, and her sense of being a heroine overflowed the screen. Although there is no clear emphasis on the age of the character, Liu Shishi's good temperament allows her to play both a young girl and a young and middle-aged man with a more mature charm. Zha Liang's status and performance in Walking with the Phoenix are also remarkable. She no longer has the youthful cuteness she had when performing costume fairy tales in the past. Instead, she has more of the demeanor of a female overlord in costume. Her performance as the queen is very immersive feel. For costume dramas, image, temperament and acting skills are indispensable. And because Yang Mi failed to meet the standards in every aspect, he overturned in all aspects. His facial condition looked old-fashioned, 
expressionless and cold, which made him look very embarrassed. Although costume themes are the domain of several actors, Yang Mi, whose acting skills are slightly worse, still overturned. The gap between male actors is even more obvious. After comparing the male protagonists in several popular costume dramas, we know that beautiful men in costumes are also divided into three levels. The Legend of Zhang He tells you what a handsome man in ancient costume should look like. First, the high-profile Reuters is still full of suspense. Xiao Zan is the real beauty in ancient costume. Xiao Zan plays the male protagonist Wang Zhang He in The Legend of Zhang He. The character design is very interesting. He was originally the son of Zhen Kuo the imperial eunuch of the Great Yuan Kingdom. Overnight, he was saddled with a blood feud. After ten years of forbearance and study, he changed his name to Wang Zhang He and returned to the capital. With his construction skills and stratagem skills, he he rose step by step in the court. Until he reached the position of chief minister of the cabinet, he made the truth about the family extermination known to the public and avenged his father's injustice. A character like Wang Zhang He, who has experienced the tragedy of killing his family, restrained his youthful nature, calculated every step of the way, and stirred up the chaos in the court by himself, is undoubtedly the standard of a beautiful, powerful and tragic power minister. In the currently airing Queen Union 2, Fans Yan, played by Zhang Ruoyan, is also a brave and resourceful courtier. However, compared to Wang Zhang He, Fan Xian has been full of buffs since birth, while Wang Zhang He is a man of great strength. From the beginning, he was promoted all the way, which was even better than Fan Xian. And seeing that the male protagonist in the original work is also a Feng Shui expert, proficient in Feng Shui, architecture, tomb repair, etc., it can be imagined that it must be full of attractions. Although Legend of the Hidden Sea has only released one poster of Xiao Zan so far, he is wearing black clothes and a black gauze hat on his head. The feeling of being deep and dignified is immediately apparent. What is surprising is that Xiao Zan's eyes in this poster are serious and sharp. He is obviously the sharp-browed and starry-eyed young man in fresh clothes and an angry horse, but his eyes look like he has been dormant for decades, trying his best to survive, which fully captures Wang Zhang He's character and feeling. Judging from other Reuters looks, Xiao Zan, dressed in an ancient robe, is also handsome to a new level, with sharp edge facial features, a highly recognizable appearance, and a sometimes gentle and sometimes sharp expression. When he was acting in an emotional scene with Zhang Jingai Yi, who played the heroine, his eyes were filled with stars and sea, but when Xiao Zan was acting in a power play, his eyes were filled with abyss. In the latest Reuters photo, Xiao Zan is dressed in black with his hair in a simple bun, riding a horse with Zhang Jingai Yi. Even under the high-definition lens, you can feel Xiao Zan's suspense even if you don't know what the scene of the two riding horses is like, you can still be struck by the beautiful atmosphere of this talented and beautiful woman. Xiao Zan proved with his strength that it is not only a fairy-like white costume that can unleash his charm and highlight his appearance advantages. Even the appearance of a scholar, the appearance of a powerful minister, or even the battle-scarred makeup is a proper look in ancient costume. Looking at Xiao Zan's perfect condition in Reuters, I no longer worry about the quality of this drama. After all, The Legend of Zhang He is also worth watching just for Xiao Zan's appearance. According to online rumors, Wang Zhang He, played by actor Xiao Zan, has the largest proportion of scenes. It is a proper male-led drama. His single script alone has nearly 300 pages, which is not only four times that of the heroine, but also in the entire drama, the adult Zhang He's role reaches 65%. This means that Xiao Zan only has a lot more scenes in the play. He already has such an eye-catching appearance and temperament, but this time, the audience can finally get enough of it. Second, costume dramas have become the hardest hit area for ugly men, and the casting is too eye-catching. Originally, the male actors chosen for costume dramas should be actors like Xiao Zan, who have high standards in all aspects. After all, costume modeling has high requirements for good looks. Comma the shape of a large bright gnome often appears. However, costume dramas have become the hardest hit area for ugly men. The casting of several dramas in succession has been very poor, which makes people feel disgusted when watching them. Liu Shishi and Liu Yuning collaborated on One Thought Off the Mountain. When I saw the scenes of the male and female protagonists, my visual experience was completely different. Liu Shishi is in excellent condition, and the chivalrous heroine she portrays his cold and sassy, 
but Liu Yuning has a cunning and cunning look on her face. Not only is she gifted with a pair of slender eyes for playing a villain, but she always smiles evilly and unconsciously when playing the role. Looks bad and greasy. But he still plays a character with a strong sense of justice, which makes people have no sense of empathy. There is a scene in the play where the male protagonist played by Liu Yuning takes the place of the emperor to fight. The simple hairstyle and crown are undoubtedly the most beautiful makeup. As a result, the moment Liu Yuning took off the mask, his appearance was criticized by the supporting actor who played the emperor beaded. In the currently airing The Little Matchmaker of the Fox Demon, Gong Jun has also successfully joined the ranks of ugly men. Gong Jun, who does not open his mouth or make any expression in the refined picture, can barely be regarded as a handsome guy. Once he opens his mouth, Gong Jun in the dynamic picture looks like an ugly man. Even though he was wearing fairy-like ancient clothes and his hairstyle tried to cover up his ugliness as much as possible, he still couldn't stop Gong Jun's big and protruding mouth. While watching the drama, I couldn't help but stare at Gong Jun's mouth. He and the heroine Yang Mi would use their pursed lips to break sentences and open their mouths to make people disillusioned. They formed a pair of crouching dragons and phoenixes that ruin the drama. Full stop. There is also Hu Yishan, who also collaborated with Zhang Jing Gai Yi. In Cherishing Flowers, he played a general who has been fighting outside the Great Wall all year round. However, he does not have the temperament of a strategizing general, and his face is even covered with a germabrasion filter. It's ground like boiled egg whites. In contrast, Zhao Zan, who has a pine-like figure and a jade-like face, is the real chosen ancient man. The handsome man in ancient costume should roll up according to this standard. Thank you for watching the video. If this is your first time watching a video, please subscribe to the channel, like and leave your comments to help us develop your channel.